Cities are where people are moving to, you get, you get conglomeration, you get people together, there's opportunities, there's work. Clearly work is coming to London, we need to build homes, we need to build communities, we need to make it a place that people want to live because there are so many opportunities. Jobs, education, housing are the three things that we, we always think are, yeah. are very important and we've focused a long time on education and got some groups up. But we've actually done three things in all of those. So on jobs, we have something called Workplace where we got 5,000 people into work last year. You know, 1,800 young people into work last year. The government's work programme with 350 young people into work over the last two years. But we know the popular, we do that by working with the employers. That creates opportunities. So you help people into work. Now, how do you make sure there's a place for them to live when, frankly, our social housing is being taken away from us? The subsidy that people get to buy it, it means we're not able to, to recreate the sort of affordability. And if you talk about 80% of market rent, that's just not affordable for people in London, so on low incomes. So what we're doing, we are in the process of building a lot of housing. For education, we have a view that we need to think about people. Our, our education results are very good in New York. They're, they're London, they're, they're, they're national average, and this is a very poor area. But we've got a programme where we give kids free school meals, we give every kid a musical instrument and three years free tuition, we test them out on 20 different sports, we get them to go to the theatre, so they get a different experience and learn a bit about London and what London's got to offer. Yeah. For me, those are the three things you do to change people and give people an opportunity. The local government has managed, by and large, with some pretty stringent cuts to deliver stuff. Why would I not think I could do that with the services government run? David Cameron said that local government is the most efficient area of government. Public health, we know and are proving we're doing that. We know that on the work what we do on getting people to work is way better than the government's work programme. So give us it. Yeah. Give us Job Centre Plus. We run it a lot better. I have young people who come to workplace and say it's wonderful you're trying to help me and they go into Job Centre Plus. Job Centre Plus, it's not about work, it's about stopping and cleaning better. Yeah. Now let us take some of these things over, and yes, I think we can deliver them much more effectively. So in cities, you, I think you put an infrastructure in, you have opportunities, you open up land, you open up that kind of physical thing, and then you look at the people and you see how do I create a community in an area, and how do I make sure people are benefiting from the opportunities that are there. So for me, it's let us let us free free us locally to do the things that can make a difference. London's brilliant. We have to make sure we keep it brilliant. And my worry is that as we drive poorer people out from the centre, we're creating, we're creating a city that will have no real heart.